Hey Planet Sewers, it's Mathlete here again. I'm here today with an item that's available on my workshop in Steam. It's an Australia themed monorail or gondola station shell. I am using the gondola here. So the enter here and the exit here are in place for a monorail. So I decided to go with a gondola. That's my favorite ride. So when you do set it up, at the beginning you could see I was tucking it in. It fits two stations, but you do have to make sure that it is very square. Sometimes it's easier to have your stations in place and then place your station shells. I did it the other way on this build because this build is unique and it goes underground with the line. Here I am changing settings so that I don't have to worry about my scenery. Uh, I did not want to lay the track with the collisions on, so I turned them all off. You can find that in the game settings. And then what I was saying before about this build, it will change your terrain so that it can fit that underground line. So that's why I placed the shell first and then fit a station inside of it. So I'm just building my rails to go over my hippo habitat and my giant otter habitat coming back around and it did not want to connect so usually you'll get a little lock right here and it said the track it couldn't do it the track was not going to meet nicely so I just brought it around like I wanted it to be and then deleted and there it goes it gave me the lock so it could connect I've tried the auto connect feature I've never really had it be successful unless it's a simple track and so now we're putting our entrance in putting the exit in again if you use the monorail the guides will be perfect so I was really trying to get this exit ramp to fit kind of in the same way so I could keep the outlines that I built around the, um, the stairs but unfortunately I have to have the strong curve just because the monorail is set back a little bit further than the gondola shell is. So I just took that stuff out and I probably should have turned rails on so I guess they're going to be falling off the stairs. I love the transport rides in the game. They're one of my favorite things to build. I like having them go all over the place. Unfortunately I like them so much that I often have all four in my zoos and it does create quite a bit of lag. And there are a lot of settings that go with these rides. I've played with them quite a bit, trying to get optimized usage. So here we go to do the queue line. It follows the green outlines that I did when I placed this the first time. It's pretty simple instructions, I think. Getting the path to cooperate is the hard part. It's really hard to duplicate the exact same angles and settings that someone else used. So for most of this, I do not have flattened terrain on. I do not have tunneling. I think I do turn it on down at the bottom. Unfortunately, every time I do this blueprint, it cuts off all of the bottom portion of the walls. So originally, at least in my zoos, it has full walls. You don't see any of the grass as you go down into the tunnel. So right there, I did turn tunneling on just in case it gave me trouble. And then I need one more and there we go. We're matching up and then getting this to recognize the other path and make a nice connection. And there we go. Sorry about the crazy camera. And then looking at the instructions again, so for this, I don't think I had the circle quite in the right place because again, I used the monorail when I pathed out the instructions. So I just modified it a little bit since it wouldn't connect straight through here. I just went through the pole around a little bit and up to get it to connect into that entrance. So what are your favorite in-game rides? The train, the gondola, monorail? or the safari ride. I used safari ride the least, I think because living in Houston, we had Astro World and we had a gondola and I used to snow ski when I was younger and I just love gondolas. So everything is set up. 
we're ready to get this open. I just put it free, try to attract some guests. And here we are in our guest POV, the first guests that are gonna ride this gondola ride. Going through the line queue. I did have Southern Cassaways right on the edge of this in my zoo, so the blueprint picked that up. You can delete that, or you can put some habitat there for them to look at while they're in line. And getting on our gondola, and off we go. It's named Airway Ruse, because Ruse was on the other side. And then there's the hippo habitat, the otter habitat, and off to look at nothing. I haven't built that section of the zoo yet. And thank you so much for checking out my gondola station or monorail station. Y'all have a wonderful day, and may the RNG odds be ever in your favor.